What's up, guys? DJ Beanpole here back again. Yes, my voice is uh, still messed up. I'm uh, still feeling a little sick. Uh, but today is uh, cycle four, week three, day three, which actually introduces us into the heavy singles uh, of the competition squat and bench press. Um, and even though I feel like shit, I mean, my pre-workout was essentially day quill, uh, I still gotta get into the gym and get it done, sick or not sick. Uh, one of my buddies keeps telling me that some of the best days he's ever had in the gym is when he goes in feeling like complete ass. So uh, we'll see if his theory is correct. Top set today for squats. I'm looking at doing 290, or just 290, 390. Uh, top set for bench presses looks like it's going to be 285. And then uh, I'm supposed to do overhead press as well. But uh, I'm not quite sure where I'm going to be programming in for that lift just because I keep skipping that damn lift because... I keep running out of time in the gym to actually do it. But it's in the middle of the day. As you can tell, I'm actually filming this in the day, so hopefully it doesn't look so pixelated. Um, I don't know what I came down with. Uh, my weight has not really wavered. I don't really feel achy or, like, just out of it. I just feel stuffy. My voice is real deep, and that's about it. So... I'm gonna go to the gym, I'm gonna try to kill it, I'm gonna get some workout footage for you, and hopefully I can bring you some training PRs. This is DJ Beanpole signing off. What's up guys, post-workout video, um, I am, pardon my French, but I am fucking ecstatic about the uh, progress that I made today. As you can tell, I didn't get any better, I'm still sick, yeah, pre-workout, day quill, you should give it a shot sometime, <laughs> I'll give you two working uh, training PRs in your session. So as you saw, um, I came into this day expecting to do nothing, I wasn't expecting, I had no optimism, I had no gusto behind me to lift heavy. I looked at the numbers was just like, this is going to suck. I feel like shit. My head's going to explode. You know, but I knew I had to get in and do something. So, went into squat and ended up getting my top set of 390. Um, and then I did two back off sets of 380. I'm hoping that the depth looks good. Uh, I think it looks okay. I'm hoping that it was at least parallel. I really tried working on depth for 350 and 370. So, you know, if you guys tell me what you think. Did it look like I was at depth? Did it look like I was at parallel? Would it have passed? Would you have given it a white light? Would it have been three white lights? Uh, and then moved on to bench press and did uh, 255 times one. Felt great. 270 times one. Felt okay. Uh, called for 285 and my first attempt, miss. Uh, just, I knew it was there. I got it about halfway up. I think I, I'm gonna, I'm talking to myself. I don't know, I haven't even set up the video yet, but I think I'm gonna put the fail in there. I knew I had it. I had to go for it again. Um, and then when I did get 285, I thought it felt like touch and go. Some of you might think it looked like it was perfect for competition. Would it have been long enough to get a press command? I don't think so. So that felt so good that I said, the hell with it, put on 290. Um, put on 290 and paused it perfect and press command and I think that would have been three white lights in the bag felt amazing I don't know where it came from five pounds over what was called for for today and then I went on and actually did overhead press 135 for six which is actually another PR but uh, great training session day maybe I should be more sick uh, sick get sick more off I don't know but uh, definitely like and film it in the daytime you guys can actually see me it's not all pixelated um, but today's training session I do have to give a shout out real quick goes out to my buddy uh, Big Z. Uh, you know who you are. 
Uh, just came off of a shoulder surgery that actually was worse than anticipated, uh, and now his recovery time is going to be prolonged. Uh, this is one of my very close friends. I was uh, thinking about him today. Uh, I know he had surgery on Saturday, uh, or not, excuse me, not Saturday, but a couple days ago, and uh, I actually hadn't heard from him, so I didn't know how the surgery went. So that was still on my mind, and I was putting that in the back of my head. Um, it was something to try to motivate myself to progress with these lifts. Um, just thought about all the cues that he had given me, um, and just really was like, you know, what would he, what would Z do? What would he do with this lift? So uh, I dedicate these PRs today to you, uh, Big Z. Uh, hopefully you uh, get get quick, uh, get better quick, and uh, get strong, because uh, you can't let me catch up to you. This is uh, DJ Beanpole signing off.